Come on, Silver Fox. <laughs> Well, hey y'all. <laughs> hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Kyra Sean. Today's video is brought to you by My First Week. They sent me another unit to review for you guys. It is also Sip and Slay, and your girl got her drink and drink today. Okay, I got some ice in there because Ken Ken had bought home some of that hard work, okay? And uh, yeah, I made, I made it too strong, and it's too early for that. <laughs> So I'm gonna go ahead and nurse that while we get into these looks, okay? Because y'all, the looks calling all silver foxes. <laughs> yes, y'all, I tried a new color today and it is a glueless look. All up in the pot, all up in the dag on part. So before we get into this install, the specs and what I think about this unit, straight out the pack. Make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also give this video a thumbs up if you wanna see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Okay, so like I said, this unit comes to us from my first wig. All the specs for my unit are right here on the screen, so if you wanna check it out, you can. This should be a very easy install because it is a curly wig, and I plan on wearing her glueless. The big thing about this wig that I'm so excited about is that it is a grayish silver color. I saw the wig on their site, and a lot of my wig mates have been asking for a gray wig, so <laughs> I'm dipping in the water real quick. So we are gonna see what this gray wig is sitting like on me. You already saw how it looked at the packaging, and it was looking a little, <laughs> I was a little worried, okay? but y'all see how these curls washed and clumped together after I brushed them with my Felicia Leatherwood brush? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. It's still pretty damp around the ends, but I ain't too worried about it because I'm going to uh, wet it up some more with my mousse. So let's go ahead and get this wig styled up really quick. I'm gonna cut off the lace on the back. You don't need that unless you plan on gluing something down to your nape, which I don't. It does have the adjustable elastic band already attached in the wig. I don't think I'm gonna wear my wig grip yet because I did tighten down the elastic band. We're gonna see how she fitting. Ooh. My first wig, pluck the hairline, bleach the knots. This looks amazing. The stock photo for this wig does have a bang. I don't know if I'm gonna use the actual bang for this wig. We'll see though. But if you wanna pull it back into like a ponytail or whatever, the hairline is already ready to go. I can definitely feel the difference between the texture of this hair right here at the root and then the hair that they colored. So it is a little different in the texture, but I feel like the curls are still gonna be really pretty together. I don't mind having two different curl patterns in my wig if it flows right. Okay, if it flows right, we here. I'm about to say where my scissors at, look at me. Asking questions before I even look. Sound like my kids. <laughs> Where is the jacket? I just told you where the jacket was, child. Let's cut this lace off with my razor. Ear tabs, ear tabs. Cut these off. Something in my eye. Ooh, this lace is looking. Ooh, did I just, let me not slice my forehead up. Goodness gracious. This lace is looking amazing, okay? Amazing. My forehead looking a little Gonna a little pronounced, but it's okay, it's okay. So I'm gonna use my Nairobi mousse around my hairline. I don't know what's going on with my bottle, but it's kinda hard to press. It looks like it's clogged, so maybe that's the issue. I used too much, but it's, <laughs> it's all right. They did send me a band. I'm pretty sure that's what this is, so. Get all fancy with the packaging. My first wig. My first wig, where's the Velcro? I need the Velcro band. I'm just gonna use my little black joint right here. Let me just pin the hair up with my little clock clip. Dang it, what happened to the band, my first wig? I need the band. Okay, give me the band. I feel like a crackhead begging for the band. Right, now time to define my curls. So it's gonna be mousse all over. I think I'm gonna do a side part to start off with to see how she looks, and then we'll go from there. So I'm just gonna do Mousse all over this side, uh oh, not, can't waste my product, I'm running out. Mousse all over here. The hair did shed a little bit during the co-wash, but not too much, and it was mainly the gray color that shed. Felicia Leatherwood brush on this side. Pump those curls. Ooh, see how they coming together? Twist it around the finger. I want this wig to have bigger, um, bigger clumps, so that's why I'm taking bigger sections to clump it. Make sure you clump the root. OK, 
Okay, so the curls are looking pretty daggone good, if I must say so myself. Hold up, this one, you was gonna sneak out of there, weren't you? Come on, silver fox. <laughs> Give me a curl. Give me a curl. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and diffuse the hair and then we'll come back and style it together. Okay? Bring that. Okay, so the hair is pretty much dry. Let's get this band off and see what we working with. Okay, okay. I'm gonna pull this down a little bit because she a little too far back. There we go. I'm put my glasses on top of the lace over my ears. Take my edge brush. Just brush some of that out a little bit so it's not so perfect looking. The hairline is looking pretty good, so we're gonna leave her alone. I just need to go in and finish up drying this hair. I'm gonna blow dry this on warm and high. Now let's go in with our pick. Pick it from the root just a little bit because this hair is more silky, so I don't want to comb the curls out too much. Let's go from the root like this. Get some lift like that. Go under. This is gonna be a cute little bob. I still have that bang. It's just under this part right here. If you want to do the bang, you can definitely, you know, bring it over to the front. I'm gonna use my bang to kind of give me some more lift. Some of y'all still gonna be like, you should have showed it with the bang. Like, <laughs> scrunch the hair up like so. I'm not gonna do a defined part because I feel like the lace on this joint is pretty, pretty bleached and it's pretty natural looking. So I don't need any type of um, excess in my parting space. But what I do need is my lip gloss because my lips are dry. is <laughs> this is a cute wig now is my lace blended I'm pretty sure it is I don't want my eyes playing tricks on me but I do feel like if I step outside it's gonna be a little ashy I gotta make sure I step outside to make sure my lace is doing what it needs to do okay which is not to be seen the curl pattern for this unit is really pretty however I do feel like the grays loosen the curl just a little bit in some sections this is a human hair wig that they have to color so the curl pattern may be a little different for each wig the hair has a lot of movement has a lot of body I could definitely do like a little um, half up half down style if I want to that could be cute mm-hmm but I kind of like it all down this is kind of giving me you know kind of giving me a vibe so I'm gonna leave her all down for now okay bars bars no glue, no adhesive. This looks, this looks real good. It falls a little short on my size based on how I cut it off, but I still consider this wig to be big head friendly. If you want to use the bang, let me just, let me just move it over so y'all can see. Okay, if you want to use the bang, you can use the bang. Okay, nothing is wrong with the bang. If it has some, um, some of the gray streaks in the bang, I think that would look a lot better. But because it's one standard color, it's not giving me the look that I want. So that's why I'm stuffing mine back up under the wig like so. So for the mature wig babes, what we thinking? Yay, nay, L let me know. Let me know down below. Well, you know, everybody. Y'all know the young girls be wearing gray wigs now too. I don't know. Go ahead and head to the VFW real quick. Get them benefits. <laughs> But that's all I got for you guys today. Shout out one more time to my first wig for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. I will put the direct link, my specs, and any coupon codes I have for this unit down below. So if you guys want to check it out, you can. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.